What up? Just thought I'd make a quick video about some import hydraulic roller lifters that I bought and I'm returning. See, the deal is they are not what they advertised. I pulled one apart, measured a few things on it, and this set of roller lifters, which you know, there's one half of them, and here's the other half, are supposed to be short travel so when i pulled it apart i was able to you know dump the oil out and measure the travel easier and they're pretty much standard ls travel uh, they were measured about 180 or 180 thousands and i measured the wheel because they're supposed they're advertised it says written in the ad it's supposed to be 700 sorry, 750 wheel and they measure 700 so that's two strikes now, as far as everything else the ad claims these lifters are, like they're supposed to be, you know, better metal and precision machined and so on. Maybe I'll put a list up like right here and you can pause and read it for yourself. Who knows? I know two of the things they claim are not true. So, do you really want to take a chance on what else they say they are? No. I'm going to go ahead and return them because I bought them through eBay. And I believe there's a couple of merchants on eBay selling these lifters. Um, I think there's also a merchant on Amazon as well. See, here's the here's the, here's the part number right here. And you can be the judge for yourself. But as they say, if a deal seems to be too good to be true, it is. And that turns out to be the case with these lifters. So I'm going to go ahead and... Slap this one back together. The merchant already agreed to take them back and refund me. I mean, I've already proved that they're not what they say they are. And eBay or Amazon is really good about false advertising. So I should get 100% of my money back. You know, shipping and everything. But I'm going to wait and upload this after I get the return so I can, you know, I'll put in the comments or the details if I actually get all my money back. So, we'll see. I got the full refund, but I almost didn't. So I figured I would make this clip to explain instead of just leaving a comment. You see, when I started the return, I took a screenshot of the ad just in case. And then later, when they gave me the refund, I noticed that they withheld shipping. And because of eBay's satisfaction guarantee i knew i was entitled to a full refund so i went and checked the listing again and saw it changed the ad from 750 roller to 700 roller then i contacted ebay and let them know that they withheld shipping and changed their ad which you know was proof so ebay went right ahead and gave me the full refund you know the shipping that they withheld in good faith I just figured I would let people know because sometimes you get these merchants to try these shady things on eBay thinking they can fly under the radar if you don't know. I don't know if the lifters are a complete scam. I did find some similar stock replacement ones that look like them. Maybe they're just counting on people not checking and measuring a few things. There it is. I figured I'd share, share with you guys what I found. Too good to be true. Thanks for watching. Keep it real.